Another cracking, colourful background of flowers. Thank you, Mrs H. Welcome to the Sunday weekend shave, and I hope uh, I find you happy and in good health. Uh, and I hope the weather where you are is exactly as you want it to be. Uh, a bit like your shaves, really. I hope, <laughs> hope, you, hope they're just as you want them to be. Right, products, bit of a mixture. Razor today is a vintage. No shavettes, nothing like that. <laughs> this is the Gillette Aristocrat. Um, and this one's between 1946 and 1948. So a late sort of 40s razor. Nice in gold. Twist to open. And a second use Wilkinson sword blade in there. Tight, nice. There is overhang to be aware of. Good weight. What's the balancing point? Roughly if it'll stay there. So, nice razor. Brush. This is the Yaki 24mm Synthetic Tuxedo Knot. Uh, beautiful, nice and soft. And talking of brushes, I just want to point something out from last week's shave. I used, uh, the last shave, sorry. I used this brush, which is the Frank Shaving. Uh, beautiful brush, lovely knot, not expensive. But I've only used it once and the gold has come out of the sort of logo there. I know it's not a big deal, it doesn't affect the brush, shave, it's still good, good quality for the price. But that shouldn't happen on the first use. Right. <laughs> okay. Sh sh shaving. Sean Connery's here again. Yes, Miss Moneypenny. This one, heading to California. Crampert's Finest Frostbite Shaving Soap, established 2011. Um, can't remember what this was like. You can smell the menthol, uh, so it's nice cooling. And there's the theme of this shave, cold water. I want to give my skin a nice refreshing cold shave. Nice now and again. If you suffer from irritation, razor burn, try a menthol soap or a cold water shave with menthol soap. Depends. Play around, but it does help the cool in and it's beautiful. So I'm gonna pre oh I'm gonna use this as well. There's the soap in the bottom. I've just put some water from my hands, the posh way, in the bottom of that. This is the Captain's Choice Copper Bowl, the heavyweight. So that's in there. Uh, what else is there? I'm gonna use Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements, the ice pre-shave soap, which is mentholated. So I'm gonna wet that. And then, beautiful, and it's sort of a lather booster. That's enough, didn't need much. Wow. Because when I've done um, outdoor shaves in the cold, the Snowdonia, absolutely beautiful. So have you had a good week? Are you having a good weekend? Or a good Sunday? Anyway? I hope so. So now we'll see cold water brush. No need to soak this synthetic. Here we go. We'll see how this lathers up. Very good so far. Yeah, I can smell the menthol. In my uh, next shave, I'm going to be using a very special razor. Um, one I've not personally heard of before, or knew existed. And it has a, all I'll say is it has a military theme. Right. That should be, it likes a drop of water, so a bit more on the brush, and then off we go. So firstly, it's not, 
in my face sort of menthol. I can smell it, but it's not uh, powerful yet. They do seem to uh, get stronger as you use them and cooler. So here we go. That's it. So the Gillette Aristocrat, here we go. Non adjustable, first pass. You can hear that baby sing. And you can hear that baby sing. Right on cue, baby. Okay, so now it's agitated or being moved about. It's uh, just slightly fumy in my eyes. Nice. Nice refreshing change. You'd think a cold water shave. When you first start out, you think cold water won't be the same, it'll be plucky. And if you've had a hot shower first and then pre shave, whatever, it's not plucky as you can see, hopefully, on here. Feels beautiful on the skin. Nice change. So what's your shave? If you're having one today, what's your shave of choice today? Some people only shave cold water. Um, I think there's a channel out there, polar shaving, is it? But um, I don't mind it. I wouldn't want to do it all the time, but it's a nice change, especially if you ever say if you have irritation, anything like that, gives the skin a break, a nice cooling. It's nice in the summer. It is warm in here, in case you see any. It's not nerves this time. That's lovely. That is lovely. Okay, back to the pack. Back to the tap. So it likes a drink, this one. Look at that, beautiful. Mmm, feel the coolness then. Look at that. Lovely soap lathers really nicely. A few drops of water on it and uh, added some as well to the brush so it likes as I say it likes a drink and that's lovely I've been looking forward to this nice change nice cooling sensation right here we go Oh, we got some. Oh, the props people have been here. That blade feels beautiful in this. It's standard sort of Gillette head, mid aggression, standard blade for me. So there's nothing. Major going on. There's some seagulls outside. Seagulls, they're coming more inland then. And in this country, seagulls are protected. You wouldn't believe that, but they are. And you've got to be careful on the coast if you're having fish and chips, because they'll dive down and pinch them off you. And ice cream, cornet, the, the cornets, 
and uh, sandwiches that are pinched. <laughs> Clever, they'll, they'll watch him. And if they think he hasn't got a grip on that fish very well, thank you, and off it goes. Beautiful, wow. Oh, it feels cooler then. So on each pass, you haven't got the protection of the whiskers, obviously, as you have on the first pass. So they protect you a bit. But as you're getting closer and closer, it gets cooler and cooler, which is nice, nice way to wake up, actually. So back to the pack, a bit of a swirl, back to the tap, and back to the face. Third, mm, third pass. Feels cooler again. Look at this soap, it's good. Have you used this soap before? I can't remember when I had this. You won't believe this now. I'm using cold water, menthol soap. I feel cool and yet I'm sweating. That's because of this room. Quite warm. I forgot to turn that thing off. So third now. I'm against the growth. Beautiful. Right, Sunday dinner. There won't be one. What? I know. We're heading out this morning. So, uh, wow, that feels nice. Um, yeah, we're nipping out. And so there'll be no Sunday dinner. But what I will do probably, I've got some thick bacon pieces which I'll slice and probably treat myself uh, sort of what we call tea time or maybe dinner time officially, 5 p.m. to 6. I'm going to have some bacon. I got some free-range eggs off a farm there. Bacon, eggs, tomato, mushrooms, maybe some black pudding as a treat. So a Sunday fry up. It's a comfortable razor this. Just does the job. It was made to do a job and it's done it and it's still here today. History in your hands. I only wish it could speak. I don't know if that's a, I've gone over where I cut last week or something, but not so bad otherwise. We haven't done this bit yet. If you didn't see that shave, worth a laugh, uh, worth a look. It's always at the end, on the end of this video, you'll see there'll be a link to it in the screen. Uh, I looked like uh, my face had been used as a dartboard <laughs> and I lost. So the feel of cold steel is a nice change. Yeah. Beautiful. Get ready. Ooh. It's not as strong, it's not as strong mental as uh, the PAA frostbite or anything like that. Mar Marguerite, what do you call it? Sterling's. Um, what's it called? 
margaritas and there's some of that. Uh, it's not as strong as them, but uh, it's, it's, it's there and it's noticeable as you go along with many of the soaps, uh, menthol soaps. Three, two, one. It's cold water, mentholated. Pick up time, baby. Right. Right, no water now, just straight. And I must say, it feels beautiful, wakes you up. Yeah, if you haven't got menthol soap, try a cold water shave. But for it to work, make sure you do sort of have a good prep or a hot shower first so you soften the whiskers and that helps. But you will feel less irritation. Can't guarantee you won't cut yourself. Because I'm the master of that. Good slickness of the soap, even though it's cold water. Wow, that's lovely. Right, we'll rinse off. Oh, it. And uh, can use Alan. You met him before. Hi, Alan. Hi, here we've had a line. No sting, which is nice. That's lovely. Rinse off, there'll be zero slickness now. Another cold rinse. Oh. Very refreshing. <laughs> My softener less towel. Only in the shaving towels, the bath towels are different or the shower towels. Okay. Right. So what I thought I would use now is something with a bit of Skin bracer, but a menthol in that. Skin bracer original from the States. You've seen me use it. Oh, there's the. Before you. Nice nose. There was a dot there, but I don't know if that was from a sort of a bit of a. Ooh, I'm here from last week, or last shave. Bit of a reopener, but uh, there's nothing there now. Oh, that's nice. Skin bracer. Beautiful. Again, nothing massively strong about it. Will you stop clicking these walls? Thank you. I know you're there. Nothing massively uh, strong about that, but uh, oh, sorry, I know what it is. Happy now. But it's lovely. Cooling, nice, just nice. And I'm going to use Parasso Green. This is a pre-shave cream, but I'm going to use it as an aftershave cream because it works just as well. Are you supposed to do that? No. Does it work? Yes. Well, it does for me. Lovely. There's a bit of menthol in that as well, you see.
mixes nicely. It'll never make you good looking, but I'll tell you what, it'll make you feel damn good. Now, because of the skin bracer and the parasso and the soap, as well, so there's a bit of a clears your eyes out as well, gives them a bit of <laughs> gives them a bit of a watering. Right, we've used the Gillette Aristocrat 1946 to 48 uh, late. God, that feels lovely now. Uh, razor with the Wilkinson sword blade second use absolutely perfect combination non adjustable overhang to be aware of beautiful razor I only wish it could speak um, that was nice cold water um, cramp crampets or crampets finest frostbite shaving soap just nice it gets it's not strong but it gets slightly stronger as you use it because you know as I say that you're cutting down the beard and it's and layers of it on, on your face all the time. Beautiful, nice, good slickness, easy to lather, doesn't dissipate. Uh, nice. Yaki 24ml synthetic tuxedo knot. Lovely. I like this sort of clear resin coloured handle. Nice. Um, Yaki, if you're watching, I know you watch sometimes. Do one in orange. Beautiful. Um, <laughs> listen to me like I'm talking to Father Christmas. Well, hopefully. Uh, Captain's Choice Copper Heavyweight Bowl. Beautiful thing. Good weight, good grip, and it works well. Um, what else have we used? We rinsed with. Oh, this was the first thing. PAA's Ice Pre Shave um, Mentholated Pre Shave Soap. Lovely stuff. We rinsed with water after the shave. Alum. And then um, rinse with water again, cold water all the way, skin bracer, aftershave, and we used Prorasso pre-shave cream as an aftershave cream. And that's good. Really nice. Ready to face the world now. Ready to go on our little jaunt. So, that's it. Have a fantastic weekend. Um, thanks for watching, and have some great shaves if you can. And uh, yeah, try and stay positive and have some, have I said, yeah, good shaves, stay positive and um, look after yourselves. And I'll see you on Wednesday for the midweek shave with a bit of a military theme. Well, the razor will be. Thanks for watching. Take care.